now to Democracy 2021 in the race for Erie County Comptroller and why some believe a new mailer is taking attack ads too far. At issue, this mailer and a similar text message sent to registered voters ahead of early voting. This mailer that was sent out by Lynn Dixon's campaign was a new low. Anger coming from Kevin Hardwick over a campaign ad sent to Buffalo City Democrats last week. The front of the mailer reads, Conservative Kevin Hardwick supports President Trump. It also shows Hardwick alongside the former president. The problem, Hardwick is a Democrat running for Erie County Comptroller, and he says it's misleading and doesn't align with his political views. That's sneaky. That's a dirty trick. Hardwick was a registered Republican, but switched to the Democratic Party in 2018. This is who Kevin is. Lynn Dixon is running for controller on the Republican and conservative lines. Her campaign is responsible for the mailer. These things are factual. Um, it's, it is who he has always been. And I think that the controller's office is no place for somebody who is a political opportunist or self-dealer. The mailer hit mailboxes Friday, one day before early voting began. Some registered Democrats also received the same ad in the form of a text message. University of Buffalo political science professor Jacob Nyheisel says the timing and tactic are common. Although he says it's difficult to tell whether the strategy will have any impact on the election. Do you think this is going to cost him votes? It could at the margins, um, but we also know that negative advertising uh, can have what they call boomerang effects, which is, you know, it's just so over the top that it ends up actually affecting the one trying to convince somebody to vote in the other direction. So I think that something like this is probably a wash.